So when you get motor oil, you probably see numbers on here like this that say 5W50 or 10W40 or 0W20 and wondered, what do they mean? Well, let's break it down like you're 12. So first steps first, the W right here, that does not stand for weight. That stands for winter, actually. And yes, winter as the freezing cold that's approaching us very quickly. <laughs> The number five in front of here that you see in front of this W is the number that tells you how easily this oil is going to flow when it's cold out. So the smaller this number is right here, that means the thinner the oil stays at lower temperatures. That means on your cold starts, your engine's gonna be able to build oil pressure rather quickly. So the second number right here, this 50, that shows how thick the oil stays when your engine gets hot. So the higher this number is after the W, it means that the better that the oil is at holding its thickness at higher temperatures. You know, for when you're racing or doing those highway pools. So now let's explain the viscosity. viscosity can simply be explained for how easy a fluid flows. So when you pour water, you see how easy that flows. That's a lower viscosity. And when you have like a honey, like thick, like substance that pours slower, way slower, um, <laughs> that's a higher viscosity. So when it comes to motor oil, we want a little bit of both properties. We want it to flow quick when it's cold out and we want it to protect the engine like this honey thick substance when it's hot. So basically you want your oil to act like water in the morning and honey when things get a little spicy. So when we're looking at the chart above, you can see how the first number shows how it behaves in cold weather. And then the second number shows how it performs at operating temperatures. So for me running this 5W50 means my oil flows easily in the winter like a five weight, but protects in the heat like a 50 well, which is perfect for me because you know my street mod Subaru where the ice cream go-getters that go right to track valve. So there you have it. The perfect balance between cold starts and hot laps, all thanks to temperature tuned engineering.